If you check the bottom area of your Cubase project, you'll see a panel including play, stop and few other buttons. We call it the transport panel. If you're not seeing the transport panel, go to transport on the menu bar and select transport panel. The shortcut key for transport panel is F2. In the transport panel you can see the play, stop and recording buttons, BPM, and the time signature of the project. On the right side of the transport panel there's a button called activate metronome to turn on off the metronome for time tracking. The metronome helps to maintain the tempo of your recordings. Let's hit the play button and it should work. As you see it's not working. Why is that? And how to fix? You can see a button next to the activate metronome button with the symbol of a simple E letter. Click on it to open metronome setup. You can open the same window by clicking on the transport in the menu bar and selecting metronome setup. If you remember, when we were talking about audio buses, we created an output stereo bus to monitor sounds within the DAW. If you see the audio click output label here, it's not selected. That's why the metronome was not audible. Let's click on the drop-down menu and select our created stereo output bus. Now the metronome is routed to the stereo out bus. I'm clicking on OK and hit the play button again to check whether it's fixed or not. As you hear it's working, but audible in very low level. We can increase the levels of the metronome too. Open the metronome settings again. Switch to click sounds tab. You can see a section at the bottom is audio click settings. There's a label called audio click level. You can adjust the click level there. Also it's possible to adjust the levels of two different sounds in the metronome individually like this. During a project, you can use the shortcut C to one off the metronome. Assume that you're going to start a project, and you have to set the BPM. You can turn on the metronome and hit the play button, then change the BPM till you sense the perfect speed for your song. Also you can change the time signature for the project.